What is up, everybody? Welcome back to Team Fish Nichols' YouTube channel. Today we have Way Back Wednesday, and on our left we have Tracy Cochran playing the Yamega Magnezone Kingdra deck, and on the right we have me playing the Don Fan, Zekrom, Vileplume, Ryanaclus. Uh, okay, is it RDL or I can't remember what the other Pokemon is right now. The 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 Legend piece. I can't remember what it's called right now. Well, let's see here. Uh, <coughs> It's supposed to say 2011 decks. It says 2001 decks. I'm sorry about that. You can blame Jared Anderson. It was his fault. He was the one who typed up the thing. Let's see here. I get three. We both get three Pokemon. Now. That's that's pretty crazy. Uh, but let's see here. Get the coin flip to see who gets to go first. Tails. And here I start a Fanfy. Two Oddish. Trace starts a Yanma and a Tyrogue. And something else, but Ken says put it back in her hand. And here we see a Copycat. Copycat says shuffle your hand into your deck and draw as many cards as your opponent has in their hand. So unless Tracy cheated, I should draw five here because she has two in play. You start seven for your turn. So get five cards here. Now we're looking for a tropical beach. The deck does play one, and there we see the tropical beach. We get another fan fee down, and uh, with tropical beach for seven, tropical beach says you you can draw cards till you have seven in your hand, but it ends your turn. So on to Tracy's turn. We we'll see your top deck of Yama, and then uh, we're just gonna see a beach for two, I think, or three. So on my turn, we get a Dawn Fan. Now, I see the Uraniclus. We need to get a Vileplume here. Vileplume says both players can't play trainer cards from hit their hands. So, I think we're just going to see a beach here. Doesn't look like we're really doing anything right now. Oh, so, I'm actually going to go for the Earthquake, which does 60 and 10 to all my bench. I think I did this because I couldn't Tropical Beach. I think I just drew... And just, <laughs> and then I couldn't play any cards down, so maybe that's why I couldn't tropical each there. So I decided to tag. Probably not the best attack to do. Um, I think we saw a Pokemon communication. Shuffle one, po put one Pokemon from your hand into your deck, and then uh, search your deck for one Pokemon. And Yon Mega has an ability, which says if both if both players, if you match the your opponent's hand size, you can use your attacks for free. So if we both have four, she can use any of Yon Mega's attacks without any energies on it. So here we see a horsey come down, and uh, we see a tropical beach from Tracy. So on to my turn. See a Pokemon collector. I see a twins. You only play twins when you're down in prizes. That's why I didn't really play it. Here we see a Pokemon collector get two Solosis. Uh Pokemon collector lets you get three Pokemon from your deck and put them on your bench. So we see two Solosis and a Zekron come out to play. Um, put a Solosis down, Solosis down. If you're close, let you move around damage counters any way you want to. So that's a cool thing here. And we're just going to see another Earthquake from me. Uh, probably not the smartest move. We're doing damage to our bench Pokemon while Tracy is setting up. Here we see a Seedra come down. Now, Kingdra does have the ability to put one damage counter on any of my Pokemon in play. But she can only do it once per turn. So here we see a, a plus, uh, not a Plusle, uh, a Pachirisu. Pachirisu has ability when you put it down, put two Lightning Energies from your hand onto that Pokemon. And I think we see a copycat, or is that a Professor Oak? Glare is getting us. I think it looks like a copycat from here. Yeah, it's a copycat. So we see a copycat from Tracy. I got a copy of my hand. And now she can just start using a Yamega's attack. The first one does 40 to any bench Pokemon. And then the second one does 70 to the active. But here we see the Solosis getting knocked out here. She's targeting down my Solosis, so I can't use them. Then on my turn, here we finally get a Twins. So now we can start <clears throat> playing Pokemon down, or get we can get any two cards from our deck. I don't have to show her, but I'm just going to use them automatically. So we get the Rare Candy and <laughs> Gloom. We get the Rare Candy into Reuniclus. And now I can move around my damage counters any way I want to. So now I'm going to put down the Zekrom. The Zekrom does have the Outrage ability. So. so we put two, three on the Oddish, two on the Zekrom. Put more on the Zekrom. Now we're just trying to figure out the best way to do this. And here we see an earthquake. Put 10 everywhere. Okay, so on to my turn. Um, let's see, what does Tracy have here? She's got the Kingdra for sure. She's got a Pokemon communication. Now we have yet to see a Magnemite come out because she does play Magnezone. Which is kind of a setup, uh, which is kind of a draw supporter kind of Pokemon. 
It lets you draw if you have six cards in your hand. I'm pretty sure. Here we see a, a, a Kingdra come out. Now she can put 10 damage anywhere. She puts 10 damage on the Oddish. Takes a prize. So now we're tied. 5 to 5. Oh, 4 to 4 in prizes. Or 4 to 6. We're not even tied. What am I talking about? I haven't taken a knockout yet. So here we see a Pokemon Reversal. Break up the Gloom. Now I make the misplay here. I forgot that the deck played Reversals. If I had known that, I wouldn't have put down the Oddish to so... So low HP. Um, that was kind of misplay on my part. I forgot that the deck played Pokemon Reversals. Like I said, if I knew that, I wouldn't have put that much damage on the Oddish. I would have spread it out more. So that way the Oddish and Gloom both couldn't be knocked out. Uh, it was misplay, misplay on my part. I just forgot the catcher effects were in this format. So we see... What was that, a Judge? I think it was a Judge. We see the Gloom get knocked out. I'm going to sit up Zekrom. Yamega is weak to Lightning. Here we see a Sage. Look at the top five cards of your deck. And a pick two, discard three. So we see three get discarded there. See an Oddish come down. A DC come down. And I'm going to be outraged for a knockout here. I think I'm trying to figure out the damage out. Um, put another Zekrom down. Trying to figure out the damage. So put seven there, one there. And uh, we just see the average for knockout. We do 40 automatically, and I think Yamega only has 110 HP. Uh, there was eight on it, so eight, nine, 10, 11, 12. Yeah, maybe that's right, maybe 120. I knew we did math right at the time. So here we see a Magnemite come down. Um, here we see a, C a Spray Splash from Kingdra. It doesn't really matter where he where she puts the damage at, because I'm just going to move it with Rihanna Klaus. And here we see a... Uh, a punch from Tyrogue that does 30 damage, and, he, and Tyrogue goes to sleep. Now, if Tyrogue has ability, well, if it's sleep, it can't be hurt by Pokemon. But So we see the Tyrogue does wake up, so now we can hurt the Tyrogue for a knockout. Here we see another DC come down to the Zekrom. Um, now, I can either outreach here, take a knockout, or I can beach and try to set up that Gloom to a Valplume. I'm not really sure what's the best play is, but I just go for the knockout on the uh, on the Tyrogue. Now it's, uh, what, 4-3 to three in prizes. Here we see Rare Candy, Magnazone. Now the Magnazone, like I said, lets you draw until you have six cards in your hand. Here we see a Reversal. Uh, was that a Heads? Bring up the Reuniclus. And is that a... Okay, I think it's a... It must be a Judge because we're both shuffling our hands into our deck. Judge says both players shuffle their hands to your deck and draw four. So it kind of is a disruption on my part. Let's see here. What four cards do we both get here? We see another Reversal from Treacy. A lightning energy going to the Magna Zone, and we see Magna Zone use his ability. And like I said, let's just draw until you have six cards in your hand. Just another, uh, it's another setup card. Here we see Pokemon Communication. Put the Yamega in. Oh, never mind. Oh, she put the Yamega in and then put it back out. So that way she can have four cards in her hand, and that way she can attack with the Yamega to actually knock out the uh, Slosis. So here we see the Zekrom come active. It's two to four in prices. Here we see a rainbow come down on the Dawn fan, we see a Twins come down, so now we get any two cards we want. I think it's too late for the Valplume. We might be in big trouble here, but uh, we're going to see what happens. So we can finally get the Valplume on lock. Uh, it took us a little while, so here we get the Valplume out. Now both players can't play item cards from their hand, and we see an Outrage for a knockout. On the Tracy turn, we see the Yama come up. Now the Yama does have free retreat, so that's why she sets it up. Here we see another Horsey come down. And uh, the best thing here is probably Calpica. I see a Pokemon Collector, Reversal, some other stuff. Not that great of cards. Now, Lost Burn does, uh, which is Magnezone's attack, it does 60 times the amount of energy cards you discard. So, or put in the Lost Zone. Alright, so let's see here. But let's see a Lightning Energy, or is it 50? I think it's 50, actually. Yeah, it's 50. I forgot for a second. So, we see a Magnezone, or Magnetic Draw, that's what it's called. The build is called Magnetic Draw. So, we see a Retreat to Pachirisu. And I don't even know what Pachirisu's attack does. I guess discard two lightnings and kill me. I, <laughs> I don't even remember what the Pachirisu did. Here we see a Fanfi come to the active spot. Here we see a Twins. Now why not send a Fanfi? Hmm. Not 100% sure. Okay, so I see the Dawn fan in my hand. And I don't know why I didn't send up the Dawn fan on the bench. So here we see a, a Donphan come out with an Earthquake, take 10 to everybody. 
Five, ten. It doesn't matter. Either way, she had the win next turn, and we see a loss turn for the knockout. So there's game one of best two out of three. Um, it didn't really matter who I sent him because the Magnism was ready to go. It was going to take a prizes next, a last prize next turn. But hopefully you enjoyed. Thanks for watching. Round two will be up next week. Look out for that. Uh, have a great day. Alrighty, bye.